Uh, here's a great series of stretches, probably designed for cyclists, but it's about upper thoracic spine extension. The starting position is really key, so you're in four points kneeling, okay, your hands on the foam roller, and what you're going to do, you're now going to start putting your forearms on the foam roller to roll forwards. The starting position is important because if you go too far away, you now can potentially damage your back. If you go too near to it, you can damage your neck as well. So it's rolling out in front of you, down your forearms, and you're trying to get this top bit of your back to move because being stuck in the saddle for a long time, you generally get stiffer through it. So it's an easy, elongating stretch. Make sure your head, though, is looking down. Don't look forwards, you're looking down to protect your neck. And you're getting the stretch which is running up through your uh, lats, through your back extension, and through your glutes too. You can modify this little tiny bit as well by going with this cross sitting like this. And this time you have the foam roller in front of you again, still on the forearms, but you're pushing it away from you. Now this is great for your glutes, you're doing it for your uh, quadriceps lumborum, you're doing it for your lats, you've got some pec in there as well, and also some core activation too. You can make it trickier by adding in this rotation, so you now get thoracic spine and rib rotation as well. It's a really good stretch and a super way when you've been in saddle for a lot of hours, just making sure you can get all those nooks and crannies to hopefully get rid of the post-ride stiffness.